hi guys welcome back to the channel today we are going to continue with our series how to understand color and contrast for classics and soft classics hey my name is lavette welcome welcome okay so for classics your use of colors should blend together in an intensity so as not to disrupt your clean and smooth silhouette monochromatic schemes are excellent and um neutrals are really really beautiful on you and for soft classics pastels are the way to go pastels and moderately bright tones are wonderful on you now monochromatic schemes also work wonderful but when you're doing this make sure to blend them in, in in intensities mix them in intensities that blend rather than contrast don't go for any type of contrast or yeah try as much as possible to avoid contrast as a classic or a soft classics or a soft classic so when you're working with contrast guys um how am i gonna say this let's say you want you love contrast and um you want to work with contrast let's say you put on a gray jumpsuit and um you just hang on a yellow bag you can see that it is contrasting but it is not calling attention to itself and um, monochromatic schemes just like this a blue jean and um, that lilac color is that lilac color or oh, yeah yeah and this color right here you can see that it blends it is not very contrasting even though they are two different colors now this is three but you can see that um, the top and the skirts are monochromatic outfits because monochromatic outfits are one color with varying levels of intensities. Then she just added that beige um, jacket right there. Um, pastels are wonderful for you. Pistachio blue, pistachio um, green and um, you just blend them. Let's say you have a warm undertone and you, are in, you love soft colors. Just wear... Um, a cream mix a cream and um, a and the mustard yellow now brown and mustard yellow also work well burnt orange and mustard yellow work really really well and um, ivory and mustard yellow you can see it's almost like it works really well now you can also mix um, maybe ivory and cream and you can see that they, they are more like a monochromatic outfit but they have their varying intensities and they're gonna look really really smooth and elegant on you okay so for um this is also a monochromatic outfit you can see it speaks for itself it has varying intensities and it's going to create interest and um use up your um very very symmetrical bone structure now you can see this is also monochromatic but one of the pinks is um deep while one is um, um light in color black and white is really beautiful it is a beautiful way to work with to um deal with contrast that blends well together now if you have a cool undertone you can just mix cream and black or ivory and black you can see this gray and black works really well nothing contrasting nothing loud um it is just there working really really smooth now pistachio blue and black works really fine let's say you love really bright colors you can just wear a yellow top and a black bottom just make sure that you wear a black shoe to you know really work with your symmetry black shoe black bottom and um, a really brightly colored top maybe like a burnt orange or a yellow now this is ivory and um the brown you can see it works really fine it looks very symmetrical it looks really smooth and um it works with a smoothly blended visual um outline and um black and white again you can never go wrong in black and white especially when you are wearing 
casual you can see this green and that um not so black skirts it works really fine and if you love deep colors you can you are warm you can work with olive um you can work with um beige is not a deep color but it works fine and um honey brown is really excellent this is a beautiful way to work with monochromatic you can see that blue top um goes well with the blue bottom and um yeah guys another deep color is um ox blood ox blood works really fine for your casual outfit guys don't overthink it blue and white works well blue and um blue and cream work well blue and yellow work well just make sure to go for um your nude color of shoe you know yeah some of us are dark skin some of us are light skin just look for a shoe that looks like your nude okay and just pair it and you're gonna look really beautiful now this burnt orange um and this black work really well if you go with the black shoe now these are three colors but you can see they blend really well guys um don't think too much about colors i don't think they are that difficult but when you're looking at the color wheel it can really get confusing just have like five colors create a five color palette wardrobe and i've seen people who have just three colors in their wardrobe and they just and everything just works together everything blends with each other we black women we like to be everywhere we like to have the whole um rainbow color in our wardrobe we have blue we have yellow we have pink we have green we have sea green we have um black and white so many colors i suggest if you're trying to build a timeless wardrobe just work with just five colors five colors are even too much according to your coloring just select those five colors and work with them let's say you love the washed out jean look you can just pair it with an ivory top and it will look like a monochromatic outfit now you can see the skirt and the top they look like they are of the same color but they are not varying intensities you pick your clothes like that and you're gonna always look timeless and people will wonder why you are always looking good you keep getting compliments women will compliment you men will compliment you they will always say oh i love your i love your fashion sense let's say you love very very bright colors like yellow please try to pair them in a dress and go for maybe a black shoe or a nude shoe your own nude shoe and you're gonna look fantastic don't try to pair red and blue and red together red blue and yellow together it's too contrasting it's gonna break up your um very very smooth and very symmetrical bone structure just um don't go overboard with contrast if you're pairing three colors make sure they blend well like maybe beige white and black you can see it works really well beige white and blue works really well and um yeah that's all for this video i hope you enjoyed um if you have any question please do let me know and i'll see you in my next video